Hey everybody, welcome back to my vlog. I haven't updated this in a while. Uh, but today I wanted to talk about, um, or I wanted to give my specific thoughts and feelings about Joey Votto. Uh, the reason why I bring this up is uh, he was announced yesterday as an all-star. Uh, he was also named National League Player of the Week, so I figured this would be as good of a time as any just to talk about how freaking awesome that guy is. Um, I'm not going to read the stats off for you. Uh, you can find that anywhere. Uh, I'm not going to read off of a sheet of paper while I do this, but, I mean, if, if you look at the stats for yourself, I mean, the guy's just freaking unbelievable. It's such a shame that his prime years, his remaining prime years, are falling during this, you know, so-called rebuild. Uh, because, honestly, this guy might go down as the best Cincinnati Red of all time. Uh, I know a lot of people... Uh, would attach that label to Johnny Bench or Pete Rose, and for very good reason, but I I just can't imagine that anybody in the history of this franchise has ever combined uh, an on-base proneness, ability to slap the ball anywhere around the ballpark or out of the ballpark. If there's anybody in Reds franchise history who's ever had a peak uh, to their career like this, I, I would like to see that because uh, what this guy do, is doing is just unprecedented, I think, in the history of the long history of the Cincinnati Reds. Uh, I consider every at-bat of his to be must-watch. Must-watch at-bat. He put so much effort and thought uh, into each and every pitch that is thrown to him. Uh, he is always, you know, giving 100% uh, when he's up to bat. He, You can tell he, p he puts in his homework, he studies the pitchers, uh, Honestly, I feel better with Joey Votto in an 0-2 count than I do most hitters in a 3-0 count. Uh, this guy can hit to all fields. He can hit all the park. He uh, is driving in runs this year, which has been kind of a stupid criticism but uh, <laughs> of his over the years, uh, mainly because he hasn't had people to drive in. I, I just think the role of the guy, I'm, I'm glad he is wearing our uniform. Uh, hopefully he retires in Cincinnati. And hopefully... By the time uh, the team is ready to contend again, he is still somewhat in his prime. It, it just sucks that these rebuilding years are falling during uh, his remaining prime years. It's really unfortunate because I believe uh, if this guy ever got the postseason spotlight again, he would shine. And all of America would know that Joey Varda is one of the best hitters in baseball. Uh, one of the best Cincinnati Reds of all time. And I just think before all is said and done, he will go down as the best red of all time. Just love the guy, as I said about four times. Uh, he, I've never seen anything like it. Um, my favorite player growing up is Barry Larkin. Uh, most people's favorite player is who they grew up watching. Uh, I have to change my mind with this. Um, Votto's made me change my mind. So, uh, yeah, I just wanted to give you guys my thoughts on Joey Votto. Uh, and I wanted to kind of pay respect to him and his great career to this point. All right, have a great day. Bye.